Huh? I ain't mowing it. I've been mowing the crap out of it. You gonna mow it? What you gonna do? Problem is when I go this way, I can't hardly see you. Well, well, I guess you'll. No, I don't mind you mowing. I ain't mowing. I'm gonna sit and watch you mow. I'm gonna do it. <laughs> right back at to, you. I ain't used to somebody standing out here with me. Right back at you on the test plot. Um, yeah. hey there, it's Pete with GCI Turf. <laughs> Hope you're having a great day today, and I'm killing the whole neighborhood. Killing the brother. whole neighborhood. This got, is Daily DIY Dude Mike. <laughs> yeah, the uh, Mike's got a YouTube channel, Daily DIY Dude. I'll link it up in the description. Check him out. Lots of cool stuff. Uh, if you like, stuff that re <laughs> the Joker sends me pictures <laughs> of ribs and cheeseburgers and steak <laughs> and all kinds of stuff. I'm like, dude, you got to quit doing that, man. Making me hungry because the stuff he cooks on there. So go check that out. Um, Mike, come up. Come down. He's in Virginia. Come down to me, North Carolina. And... He's going to take my skag home with him to try it out and see if he likes it and that kind of thing. So, he come to pick it up and we're going to do a little test mowing with it and get him familiar with it. And then we're going to reel mow, then we're going to put some fertilizer down. So, we got all kind of things going on. We're going to make about three different videos out of this. So, uh, Sounds like fun. It'll be cool. Uh, tall fescue over here, that's the spreader elite. We've been cutting it at three inches. And uh, I'll probably continue to cut it at three inches just to see how it does at that height. So let's go. Let's do it. Do you know how to crank it? This is way easier than renovating the yard. <laughs> oh yeah! Last time I, Mike I might not was even here. Sweat. Last time Mike was here, all this was dirt, and we were cutting up sod and laying sod, and it was a she looks, that was a hard day's work. She man. looks good out here. But it's it's really it's yeah. different now, isn't it? Yeah, she's turned on now. Yeah, looking good. No, I don't know how to start it. Oh. <laughs> so this one's super easy uh, to start. Um, that's, that's your throttle, all the way forwards choke. And once it fires, just like any other mower, back mm -hmm. it up. And then this is your go, mm -hmm. go button. Yeah. Uh, that's all. And then when you want to mow, you mm -hmm. pull this back, squeeze that. Ooh, watch your fingers. That's right. Go. That engages the blade. This engages the blade. Uh, that makes it go. Gotcha. And the height set, so it's it's ready to go. Fire it up. Oh, gonna, I don't want to mess this stripe up on the. You uh, ain't gonna mess it up. We're gonna mow you in a minute. Okay. Um, what I do is just cut right across there. And what I normally do is clean that corner up, and then go over to the fence. And now, when you mow to the fence, watch your tires and don't let it fall down in my my pine needles. My, yeah. Because yeah. my you, groove's brother. deep and you'll skin it. I know it. about a deep groove, brother. You, you see my sidewalks? You skin my grass and, yeah. You know it rhymes with grass. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to be on it, too. I thought you said you knew how to crank it. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, you. Yeah, what you told me to do.
be missing spots, bruh. Look, but that's with no striping kit whatsoever. Yes, it good. That ain't too bad for no striping kit. <laughs> yeah. That joke is glowing, boy. So what do you think? That's, that's the first time he's ever used this mower, so we're gonna get kind of a first yeah. impression. And I love it, so the only other commercial mower I've ever used is the X Mark 30. And that's what, the one I redid, when the one you gave me uh, years ago. Thing is, hands down, a better mower. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, it's balanced, just perfect. We'll take it, cuts, some... it cuts really clean. Yeah, too. I mean, you can, this is with no striping kit. No striping kit, and it's just, it looks really good. Glowing. Yeah. Yeah, I love it. I appreciate you letting me try it out. And yeah. See if I like it. So Mike's gonna take it home, see if it's something he wants to get or whatever. And uh, yeah, he's got. What do you got? Eight thousand square feet. Yeah, roughly right at eight. And you use a Toro Time, Time Master. Master now. Yeah. And how yeah. long does it take you to mow? Maybe twenty about, minutes. Uh, about an hour to do everything. An hour. What? A, just to mow, probably maybe thirty minutes. Yeah, about thirty minutes. To, I don't know if it'll speed it up, but I think I the think, quality of cut I think the quality of cut's times. gonna be yeah, a lot this, better. I mean it stands yeah. everything up, mm -hmm. but the suction I think on this is ten times better. Yeah. It's got crazy suction on it. Yeah. And again, this ain't no skag don't sponsor me. They don't pay <laughs> me no money to say this. That's my mower. I bought it from a dealership, paid full price for it, and uh it's just a good mower. It is what it is. The few little quirks I have about it is the, the transmission. I would rather it be like a one, two, three geared transmission. That's personal preference. Uh, oh, you mean like a shifter? Yeah, like a shifter, like gear one, two, yeah, three yeah. instead of- See, I like of, that. See, I'm used to the uh, personal base on the Time Master. Yeah. So that, that's perfect for so me. So see, all that's personal preference stuff. Yeah. I, just, I like it one way, he likes it Because I definitely wouldn't way. like the uh, gears because then I'd have to remember to, when I want to slow down to put it in the first gear to- Well, I don't slow down. That's, Oh, okay. Well, that's probably... Yeah, that's, that's what I'm saying. I, I like more than one speed. But anyway, and then the bagger. And he'll he'll figure out the bagger part yeah. uh, when you go to take it on and off. It is a little bit cumbersome, Shoot, but I might you, start, you might better get used to it. I might even start mulching or side discharging. I need to start doing it. I got it. the mulcher uh, kit that goes with it and the side discharge, so yeah. you can take that on. It was one of, what was the other thing that I didn't like about it? Um, oh, the uh, parking brake. Was one of no, the no, 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 the flap on the bottom of the deck where it's got that little flap that hangs down. Uh -huh. And that, that, that has nothing to do with fescue. That's strictly for mowing short. Oh, okay. Oh, Cause, yeah. Because that little flap drags the, the grass this too little much. Piece, this little metal yep, piece. Yep, yep. Now, yeah. if, you're cutting it, if you're cutting it two inches or higher, so too, it uh, doesn't affect you. But if you're cutting it two inches or lower, that's going to get in the way. And to... Uh, Ever since I've known he was going to let me uh, test this thing out, I went down a rabbit hole with the Skaggs. Yeah. <laughs> to their defense, they actually, the newer model, it um, they actually corrected that problem. Oh, really? Yeah. What yeah, dang? It, it's, uh, it's it made flat. it like an attachment to where you could take it off or something on really? the bottom. Yeah. So okay. they, they definitely addressed it and they fixed it. Okay. So they must have been watched, they must have watched your last video. <laughs> yeah, okay. Whatever. Well, there you go. Uh, just a little quick mowing video. We get a little first impression on the skag with Mike. And uh, as always, I appreciate you taking time out of your day to watch. I'll check you later. Check you. Check you. Check you later. <laughs>